South Korea's next-generation fighter jet, the KF-21 Boromay, conducted a supersonic flight test for the first time. The test was carried out by the 3rd Flying Training Wing of the Republic of Korea Air Force or OKF on January 17, 2023, flying from Korea Aerospace Industries Facility near Sakjin Airport, South Korea. The flight verified the structural stability of the aircraft at supersonic speed. The Defense Acquisition Program Administration highlights that the Borme is the first indigenous design to break the sound barrier. The Kai T-50 Golden Eagle trainer also reached supersonic speed for the first time in 2003 but was developed through technical cooperation with the United States. Securing supersonic capability is a major part of the project as it means key functions work smoothly irrespective of flight speeds. According to the Defense Acquisition Program Administration DAPA, the prototype of the 4.5-generation fighter jet surpassed Mach 1 at an altitude of 40,000 feet at 3.15 p.m. after it took off at the 3rd Flying Training Wing of the Republic of Korea Air Force in Sakjin, South Gyeongsang Province at 2.58 p.m. The warplane landed at 3.54 p.m. after flying over the country's southern waters. Defense Minister Lee Jong-sup hailed the development as a historic feat. Through the success of the supersonic flight, our military further solidified the foundation to construct a robust fighting force based on science and technology. We also took one step further to the goal of becoming the world's fourth largest defense exporter. The TF-21 project, formerly known as KFX, which was aimed at manufacturing a fighter plane with higher capabilities than a KF-16 fighter, was initiated in March 2000 and won by late President Kim Dae-jung. The ROK Air Force plans to secure 120 advanced multi-role fighter jets by 2032 to replace its aging fleet of F-4s and F-5s under the project. Korea and Indonesia signed a deal in 2010 to cooperate on the project, under which Jakarta would fund 20% of the total development cost of 8.8 trillion won, $7.1 billion in exchange for a number of planes that would be manufactured there for the Indonesian Air Force, as well as for technology transfer. What is the KF-21 Borma fighter jet? The KF-21 Borma is a result of the long-running KFX development program, a joint development between South Korea and Indonesia. G Aviation, another partner of the project, supplies F-414 engines used on F-A-18E-F Super Hornets, and Saab JS-39E-F Grepens. The first aircraft prototype conducted its maiden flight on July 19, 2022. Mass production of the 4.5-generation fighter will commence in 2026. The Oro KF hopes to receive 120 KF-21 fighters by 2032 to replace its aging fighters, namely the F-4E and F-5E.